Imran Khan, physics faculty in the RZR Academy, the best coaching institute for me. Today we had a parent teachers meeting at West Mamalam Centre. Whoever is given to us as a student here should get molded to become exam oriented as well as to fulfill their aspirations. That is the main aim of all of our hard work. Daily we should check the homework. Uh, are they doing or not? That thing we will do. Uh, we are doing again, but uh, daily the report we we should send. So we'll send that report from our side. Main issue what the parents face is the excess usage of mobiles and uh, untimely sleep. The study habits are not really regular. Actually, we have to know about the uh, student done in their home. What is the how, how many hours they are preparing? How many hours? Uh, uh, what they are doing? Okay, we have to first have to collect from parents. Set. After that, we have to explain what he is doing, what he or she is doing. Such kind of lack of awareness could be one reason for which they need real guidance. So they expected guidance as well as some kind of monitoring from our side. Uh, I advise the parents that uh, you should just. Uh, take care of your child, what they are doing in 24 hours. Just ask only sit sit with them at the end of the day and for 5 minutes what he or she has done in 24 hours. From morning till evening what she has done or he has done in the, la in the 24 hours. That thing you should ask. That is my advice from the, uh, to the parents. And As a student, whoever aims at something, first of all they should set the goal. They should work for the goal. It's not enough if you set the goal. We have to work for the goal. And for that, individualized plan should be there. Same way, parents also need tips for their monitoring or their support. RGR sir has given the materials, RGR materials are given, NCRD is there, and many UI gives years questions are there. So, from the books, they should practice. And if they have any doubts, they can ask the teachers. Students never feel like they are not cared, they are cared, but they should not also feel that they are over cared or they are not. And it also gives a lot of hope, it boosts their self-confidence. Okay, there may be like uh, grievances from parents side, grievances from the admin, uh, like one who is taking in charge and even from the faculties. But somewhere a solution can be attained by coming to a uh, kind of agreement. There should be an agreement between the parent or among the parent, student and the teachers. Like it should be, we have to work in team. The main aim should be all of them should try to get through and enter the cutoff marks. Initially, they have a lot of doubts. Is there after each and every faculty have to extend this word? They are also they are all doubts, also, all doubts, are, all questions are to resolve, and they are very happy to uh, complete. They have to go to their. They have to go. Uh, actually, what happened? They have they don't know. Actually, they initially they ask something after this meeting. This what they know what to do in their home. How they have to care their children. After that, after uh, after come back from academy, what they will do? Or uh, in some of these parents actually sincerely said, "Sir, here after we have to take care of our child." Actually, we are also said actually that we are hey, you are children, your children's success is what not only teacher, your population also needed, then only she they have to get hundred percent success. The faculties are cooperative. And today we realize that even the parents are so cooperative, they are ready to accept whatever we propose or we suggest. Better late than never. Now if they start also, it's not too late. Hope they will definitely achieve. I request the parents don't allow and don't allow the, your child to uh, use the phones. We have only six, uh, seven to eight months, and this is very precious, precious time. If you study, work hard. If you work hard continuously, seven to eight months, definitely you'll get the government college of your choice. Individually, I will also say I will do this, I will do that, but it never happens. As an individual, everyone has their own defect. He or she will have its own defect, and. Uh, today's children have a lot of distractions compared with us. They have media which is most distracting. It can be movie, it can be mobile. The technology is useful but the technology takes them to unwanted ways as well. So these things, if they are preparing, they cannot get monitored nor they can get control. Here parents and teachers both are ready to control and monitor and not only that, the subject proficiency 
and the subject guidance can be given only by a subject expert. I may be a biology teacher, but I cannot help my child who is appearing for medical or uh, JE. I cannot help him for chemistry and physics. So I have to depend on my fellow uh, colleagues who are teaching physics and chemistry. So that's how parents also realize that the academic guidance comes from the rightly qualified people who are experienced and who know the nuances of the examination and the tricks of the trade. Most of the teachers, like I have seen chemistry teaching certain tricks. I too teach certain tricks, certain shortcuts. Though it may not be possible that like a numerical subject and a theory subject, but we all try, we teach so many ways to get the uh, easy way out. Like everything is hardship, but in that hardship, there, there are certain planned ways in which students can achieve. This is the competition. So we are competing 25 to 30 lakh students per year. So I request continuously study and work hard, definitely you will get your uh, government policy. So always, uh, nobody can achieve anything without a guru, whether it is uh, spiritual or whether it is uh, academic side. So here the guru is like exactly the guide. We are more of facilitator rather than teaching.